Hi guys, today we're going to be going over cervical lateral flexion. In order to do this, you're going to need to find the C7 spinous process on your client. To do that, you're going to have your client bring their chin to their chest, and it's going to be this bump right here. That's where your fulcrum is going to go. After you've found the fulcrum, you can have them go ahead and bring their head back up, and then you place the stationary arm perpendicular to the floor and the movable arm goes up the midline of their head and you can use the occipital protuberance as a guide. Now to complete this movement you're going to have the client bring their ear to their shoulder without lifting their shoulder. So Jackie if you could go ahead and take this ear to this shoulder without raising this shoulder I'm going to measure. Jackie has about 32 degrees of cervical lateral flexion and the norm is 22 degrees.